Today we're going to learn how to set up a servo valve for a liquid direct command using the edge display. I'll start by pushing the setup or the wrench icon. I'll select application. Select the controller tab. Highlight my controller in the list and press the wrench. Select controller settings and control valve settings. As you can see, my control valve type is set to inline servo, and I have a few different options. Inline servo would be when my servo valve is directly controlling the solution line going to the boom. Bypass servo, my servo is controlling the fluid going back to the tank in the agitation line. And a pump servo, where we have a servo valve controlling the hydraulic flow to the pump itself. In this example, I'm going to use an inline servo. Allowable air will always be set to 2%. Valve response 1 and valve response 2 can be set at 124. If I had a fast type servo valve, which is common with a pump servo or when using anhydrous ammonia, my settings would be valve response 1 at 40. And valve response 2 at 10. Response threshold is my fine tune value. The higher I take that value, uh, the more sluggish my rate will be to respond. So if I have an erratic rate, I want to increase response threshold. For more information on servo valve setup, please consult your user manual.